It all started with a number two pencil, a piece of paper, and Andrew Little's parents nurturing a budding artist. They would put me in art classes when I was like really young. And it was something that I just really enjoyed doing, so I just stuck to it um, throughout school, throughout high school, um, all while playing sports. Growing up, Little loved basketball and golf, but his attention turned to sports shoe designing when a college recruiter visited his art class at Nicolet High School. She put a, a shoe rendering on the, on the board, on the presentation, and she said it was done by this, uh, you know, this, this student that went to, went to CCS and he was now the design director at Jordan and he was black. And I kind of was just like, I never had seen that before. I didn't, I didn't, you know, attribute black footwear designers at that time. That moment opened up a world of possibilities that led Andrew to Nike's headquarters in Oregon. So I was an intern for three months and, and that was basically just like a three month job inter interview. After the three months, I, I was luckily hired. And Since joining the Nike team, Andrew Little has designed a number of tennis shoes you can find online and in stores. I see people in the airport when I'm traveling, like wearing my shoes sometimes. So it's, it's pretty surreal, like it's a, it's, it's pretty cool though. And he has a few high profile fans to sport his designs like these slip on sandals. Most recently LeBron, he actually wore a pair of, of shoes that I designed in the finals for, uh, for game five. Last year though, Little who was once a ball boy for the Bucks got the chance to design his home team's city jersey. So it was really about like, how do you storytell and how do you take elements of Milwaukee that, you know, people are familiar with and really, you know, explain that and explore that in a, in a jersey for the city. It was a huge honor. Um, it's, still, it's still a moment that I, I, can't, I can't believe. As our country is faced with addressing racial injustice, Little believes brand responsibility will be more and more important. A Nike that relies so much on, on the people and the communities that make them great and that, that make their product really stand out. Um, and so I'm just happy to be a part of, you know, the Nike brand to, to really, uh, you know, drive that, that vision home. Andrew Little is living his dream as a sports apparel designer, and he hopes that he can inspire other youth to do the same. If you don't recognize other people in that space, then how will you be able to, you know, attach yourself to that vision?